Good morning, fellow Ambazonians. I want to congratulate the Ambazonian forces, our brave hero that took out Cameroon occupation uh, convoy that was escorting Brazzaville's uh, drinks, a counterband in Ambazonia along uh, Kumba Balangi Road. This attack, the success of this attack, shows that Cameroon is defeated. Cameroon should leave our land. They should end the occupation. Cameroon's president, Paul Bia, cannot be struggling to organize election in a territory he does not control. How can you justify any legitimate election in a country where you don't have administrative presence in over 80% of that territory? So the attack have shown how we have improved our technology with our IED. The, the armor car Piesa technology is effective. Cameroon is losing more forces in Ambazonia than the Americans were losing in Iraq and in Afghanistan in the last years of their occupation of those countries. And Cameroon will lose. There is no way a occupying power can win a battle in a country where it does not have legitimacy. Cameroon has lost its legitimacy. It does not rule over Ambazonia. The Ambazonian people have taken back control of their territory and we are now instituting our own local Ambazonian Transitional Authority. So Cameroon is defeated. Cameroon should leave. There can be no legitimate election in our territory. And those Ambazonian citizens who are resident in Yaoundé, who have been paid by President Paul Bia to stage these so-called elections, senatorial elections, should not be seen as legitimate representatives of our country. They are impostor. They are not permanently resident in our territory and they are not in touch with our local population. These are the same people that participated in the 11th February Youth Day celebration in Ambazonia. In Bamenda, we saw people being used, and um, Bororo people from Old Town were used to carry placards of schools that are closed. So it's a sham. The occupation has failed. The assimilation attempt has failed. The conspiracy to hand Ambazonia a sovereign territory to an independent Cameroon has failed and the international community should take their responsibility and acknowledge this fact. Ambazonian can never live with La Republic du Cameroon in this union. The union has failed. The only way forward is for the Ambazonian people's right of self-determination to be recognized because we are not going to accept any circumstances where we are forced, we are subjugated by foreign state Cameroon to live as a captured people. We will fight as long as it takes for Cameroon president and the state of Cameroon to come to their senses that this is an unwinnable war. More of their sons and daughters who are sane, who are recruited to be sane in Ambazonia, will come and meet only one thing. Their death, their imminent death is a matter of time. Wherever you are in Ambazonia, carrying Cameroon military uniform and their guns, know that it's just a matter of time before our brave hero will meet you. We are fighting in our territory, in our turf, we don't lack soldiers, we don't lack the motivation, and we will get you sooner or later. Leave Ambazonia now or die in the hands of our brave heroes. And for our soldiers who continue to lay their life on the ground for our people, they are doing the right thing, they are doing the honorable thing, they are doing the just things, and history will prove them right. God bless you.